Shalom Saints, if you are a part of a community or a home assembly within Straightway and interested in submitting a video for Straightway TV, please have your leadership reach out to Michael Israel. Bless you. All right. So class is back in session. And it's not raining, but we are still training. Right? So now what we're going to do is we need to put those caps on 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 these pipes. Okay? I put it on the other end, Madison. Here? Yep. Yeah, you, everybody gets your hair in Yeah. All right. That's on there. Go ahead, Tyler. You. Put, put your cap on yours. Right. Do we need to wipe this plastic out? Nah, it'd be oh. fine. Alright. All right. So we should write our names on them. Put them on the ground like that. And now what y'all gonna do is get that shovel and put dirt in there. Now look, don't don't pack the dirt down real tight. So don't go in there and push it down because if you do that the uh, roots are gonna have a hard time growing down there. Mm -hmm. All right, so go Line over there, get, get dirty. It's time to get dirty. Yay. So I'm putting this dirt in here. Right. So the next thing we're going to do is the seat. Alright, now put those boxes right under here. Alright. Alright. So now y'all fill, fill them things up. That's all you get in there with Okay. That's right, get dirty. I don't want to get dirty. <laughs> well, that, well, my dad said that for food I mean, for your skin. Can I go ahead and pull those up over there? Mm hmm. So, what I do, Madison, is just get the bag, get the bag of dirt, and put it right there on the table. What are y'all planning today, Madison? So we're going to be planting burdock in these tubers. All right, help, help. <laughs> and in these pots, we're going to be planting some Y'all get a little system going. Some what? This some one dandelion. Over here. Dandelion. The reason why we're so planting not, the burdock you in do here this is one, because right? they have a long tap root and they like space. So we're going to give them a nice long tube to put the ropes in. And it's also easier to harvest them. So you just cut the tube up. And just get your, your burdock. Oh, right, our name is Sam, Sam, leave that. Oh, you want to put the rest of the dirt in here? All right, so take the shovel. Hold, please. And then, hey, get a marker, and you got, every, everybody's going to name their burdock uh, plant. All right, you want me to write yours? Just say, um, Carolina is Madison's plant. Mm -hmm. What you need to do is sell me what it has in it. 
Cause y'all, oh, y'all gonna be it's learning. It's a good blood cleanser. Uh, y'all need to be watching videos about what this has in it, how this plant is. Y'all need. I want y'all to know everything about this plant that you get ready to grow. So look right? at this. This shovel yeah. has measurements on it. Uh -huh. So just so y'all know, G Wiz info. It's so a half. So a quarter of an inch mm -hmm. is half of a half an inch. I call yeah. mine granola. Get it? Granola. Get it? Oh, good job, honey. Granola. <laughs> <laughs> what we're gonna do? We're going to bury these up under the surface by half by a quarter of an inch. A quarter of an inch is half of a half an inch. So, so you see these little marks right here? You see the one fourth you see the one fourth sign? Mm -hmm. Alright, y'all see that? It says one fourth. That's about half of a half an inch. Okay? Show them with your finger how long it is. So that's about about that much. Are you gonna put it right next to your stomach or right? Right up under my that's what it says. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do a little pinky. Do that. Not too much of a just like that. And then y'all come closer if y'all want to see it. Just like that. Okay. I don't know if y'all can see it, but that's how it's going to look. And we're gonna take the seed. These are how the seeds look. These are how the seeds. And we're just gonna take one. You only need one. And we're gonna put it right there, okay? Yep, and then we're just gonna take it. We're gonna cover it up. And then we're gonna get some water. And we're gonna put a little bit on there. Not to the point where it drowns the plant, but just where it keeps it, yeah, it keeps it moist, okay? So you're barely even putting a hole in it. That's good. Like so we're gonna get you one. Hold on, hold on. You already planted, Madison? Yeah, I planted okay. mine. All right, you gotta take them on the seat. You gotta put it in. All right, you're gonna cover it up. Okay, Tully, did you see what she did? Pay attention. Did you see what she did? Okay. Let me see your hole. Oh, that's too deep. It needs. To... All right. It needs to be just like that. Yes, that's that's perfect. Alright, mm -hmm. so we're gonna take your hand right here. Okay. Alright, take that seed, don't drop it, and put it in that little hole. And then you're gonna cover it up. Don't pat it, because you don't want it to be compact, because then it won't be able to break down of this hole. So this is common dandelion. This is very good for the liver and all that. You can also use it as a um so you, you can use it, instead of having tea, I mean coffee, you can make dandelion coffee. So you can like grind up the roots, dry them, put them in your, that can be your coffee, and it's really good for your body. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna look at the directions, and we're gonna see how low they need to be, um, they need to be sowed. All right, now y'all gonna plant those. Dandelion. Um, Paul, you wanna share a plant with me? Okay. I'll share a plant with you. Her listening to Sister Crystal, she would say she would put them on the surface and then she just put them all, down. Just like, just do that. So, so they need to be like a, like a six, that's like half, they need to be sewn in like half of a quarter of an inch. So that's like. So it's just enough dirt so the direct sunlight's not hit. Yeah. Alright, and you're just gonna, you're gonna put some dirt aside and you're gonna just. Sprinkle it everywhere. You gotta like. Yeah. Not the dirt. Wait, so we can't put them under the dirt? Yeah, you just want to shake the dirt around. You don't want to. You don't want to cover them really with the dirt. They, they just need to be pressed into the dirt, basically. Oh, I had them. I, I put them. In. It's okay. It'll work. Real small. Uh, yeah, probably like you want to plant a dandelion seed or that. Yeah. Okay, give me a hand. Make sure you don't pat anything. I am. Okay, I'm gonna take a little bit of yours. Tell you, don't, don't do that. 
All right, just gonna take a little bit. What we're gonna do, we're just gonna sprinkle them like this, okay? Just a little sprinkle, sprinkle. Sprinkle, sprinkle. Okay? Like some season on. Yeah, okay, yeah. Do this as an experiment, see if it works or not. You can try different methods. It's always good to have different methods and experiment. Hallelujah. Good job, Talia. Who's next? Ariana? No, don't spray it. Second. You can put a little bit more. Women that are pregnant are, and that are trying to get pregnant should not take burdock root. Burdock's scientific name is Arctium lapa. Also and good at purifying the blood and can destroy cancer. Burdock root, also known as gobo root, in southern and western Asia, strengthen the hair follicles and hair shaft, which is good for hair growth. The dandelion ha has a lot of. Oh, vitamins. Dandelion helps your liver. Dandelion can boost your immune system. It can purify the liver and blood, and it helps with anemia. Also, dandelion is very high in nutrition and helps lower your blood sugar levels. It also has potassium, iron, and more great vitamins. Dandelions contain minerals and vitamins that are essential for hair growth. Let us know if you use dandelion or burdock fruit. If you are part of a community or home assembly within Straightway and interested in submitting a video for Straightway TV, please have your leadership reach out to Michael Israel. We welcome more righteous content.